Good morning, everybody. I hope everybody's having a great day today. Uh, John Boy did pretty good that day is yesterday. I like he did good. Got three silvers yesterday. We're gonna do a little something different today. John Boy's gonna got the day. I actually brought John Boy's Equinox. I've seen him using these headphones, Thresher, and I wanna. I've always been wanting to try them out. I have never tried them, so I'm gonna give the Equinox a test today using this. And we also can compare some notes on some targets and all too. So I like to kind of see what his targets get and what this Equinox gets. So stay tuned. We're gonna hit him up right now. Here we go. All right, we have not dug a single coin yet. So I'm at a block. John Boy's digging right there. And I got a target right here. 23 on each equinox. That should be maybe a penny, maybe, I guess. If I remember right. It's been a while since I used this thing, so I'm not really sure. All right, we got it out, I think. Yeah, we got it. All right, let's see what we got here. There it is. Yep, it's a penny. First target of the day is a penny. Is it a weedy? I uh, can't really. No, it's definitely not. I'll just keep digging. I got my first relic. I got a wheat scent right here. We know this area is producing some old coins and stuff. We dug five silvers out of here yesterday. So we're thinking there should be some gold in here, but I don't know. Maybe an old gold right here. Let's check it out. Here we go. All right, we're just digging a few coins, but John Boy has got something big in the basket. Holy smoke, John Boy. What is that? That is big. Holy smoke! Come on, man. It's a silver dollar. Oh my oh, god. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Holy oh, yeah. smoke! Look at that. That is a silver dollar. Unbelievable right there. All right, man. That is awesome, John Boy. Lord have mercy! You got a good one there, John Boy. That thing actually came in low, so it was probably sitting vertical in there because it was like a 60 some. but I guarantee it's not when you lay it flat. Wow, look at that. Good job, John Boy. Oh I, that makes the day right there. Right. Silver dollar. Awesome. All right, man, that's awesome, John Boy. Got a silver dollar. I can't believe it. I got a high, somewhat high number here. It's 29.30. Doesn't sound real strong on this. I'm ready to go back to the dais now, man. Holy smoke, John Boy digging silver dollars with the dais. Man. All right, this out. I'd love to get a piece of silver there. All right, there's a quarter, but I don't think it should be silver. Nah, it's not. I see the end on it. Man. I'll right, just keep getting that. All right, we know there's silver in here. Whenever I get a high tune, 28, 29, I'm recording because, man. I just don't know. Especially a silver dollar. I've never dug a silver dollar. That's pretty cool. That's for my bucket, just a silver dollar. That's pretty cool. Uh, 1891, too. I think John Boy said he looked at the date. 1891. That's pretty cool. All right, we're out here. And it is a quarter, but it's not going to be silver. Like I said before, the silver ones will be kind of a grayish color. Not that color. All right, here we go. All right, I ventured out to the deeper water, and it's clay down here, so anything good should go to that clay. It's right where John Boy got the silver dollar. So, only thing I dug so far is a 50 cal casing, but we're gonna try it out here just for a little bit anyway. Here we go. All right, got 13.15. Let's see what John Boy gets on the dais here. All right, what we got, John Boy? What number? 67.68. Yep, that, that's a gold area number, but we're digging a lot of brass in here too, so it uh, could be just some junk. But anyway, it seems like the detectives are pretty much sticking with each other but yeah it's a piece of brass up here but it would have been good on either one of our detectors to dig right there all right we're still testing it out see what we can do here we go all right john boy wants to check this target we got a solid 18 19 what do you get john boy on the day 79 79 that should be a penny when you think yeah that's a penny number we're seeing both of our machines pretty much read the same and so far it seems to be pretty good but John Boy got a silver dollar though I ain't got man I'm loving that John Boy I don't see anything yet John Boy is it out there oh there it is right there in it up tied oh there it is piece of copper no, I think we got a coin. is it a coin it's a nickel oh it's a nickel okay that thing's been there for a while ain't it John Boy been there a while Look at that right there, all the crustacean all over that nickel. Man, you got to bust that off there. Man. Wow. Okay. Well, we both would have dug that, so good comparison. All right, it took me a minute just to get 
acclimated back to using the Equinox. I, I still like the machine, but I'm kind of leaning a little toward the dais now after kind of listening to both of them side by side and um, kind of hearing the different sounds off. I'm, I'm, like, I'm kind of liking the dais a little better than John Boy. All right, we're going to keep using the uh, Equinox today. This may be my last time I use it unless I'm in a bind. I have to get a stack of machine, but I'm going to still use it today and see what I can do here. John Boy, I think I finally got a piece of jewelry. That's a, uh, and it's stolen silver. I got stolen today, John Boy. Might be part of a ring, Gig Master. You think it might be part of a ring? Could be. It could be. It could be. It could be a stone on top of a ring, maybe. Finally got me some silver. I like it. All right, let's keep digging. Here we go. All right, just took a hold of that. I've already gotten two bullets out of my strap, and I'm still hearing stuff in the hole, so I think it's just a hole full of bullets. I'm giving up on that one, John Boy. Too many bullets in the hole. Five bullets out of the hole, but John Boy got a big one out of the hole. <laughs> Holy shit. bigger than yours. Oh, my God. That's a live one there, John Boy. Yeah, it is. Holy smoke. It might still be active, too. You don't know. 50 caliber. 50 cal. All right, let's keep that pointing away from us, John Boy. Woo! All right, let's keep digging. All right, I just got a hit. I looked down. I got ready to stick my scoop in it, and I saw that right there. Oh, I'm going to hold it right here. Just like I'm thinking it's a ring. What do you think, John Boy? That is a toe ring, baby! Go. I got my first silver toe ring for today. I'm loving a ring. Awesome. I'm liking it. We got silver ring right there. All right, let's keep digging. Here we go. Awesome. All right, check the shells out. Got a lot of shells are washed up here. It's a nice little, little small conch shell right there. We'll save it. But anyways, a lot of shells all in here. Pretty cool. All right, quick update. We're still digging a few coins here and there, but John Boy's got to be gold in here. I know there's gold in here. There's gold in here. All this old stuff we're digging. And back in the day, 1891, well, in the 1900s, all, all they had was gold. It's not like the day we got a lot of the uh, tungsten carbide and all. It was all gold. And they lost it back then just like they lose it now. So it's definitely some gold in here. I don't know if we're going to find it today, but I'll guarantee it's some gold in here. We're going to try to find it right now. Here we go. All right, we couldn't find that gold. John Boy hit a little coin hole and uh, dug a bunch of coins out down there. And I dug a few more up here on the, on the dry sand. But, uh, we gotta get something to eat. I'm hungry, John Boy. That's me, man. We gotta get something to eat for him. Maybe one more beach, so stay tuned. We'll see what else we can do. All right, John Boy, I made it back to the beach. And I just dug a little earring. I don't think it's gonna be gold. It had the right number, but it's so small, it's probably uh, not gonna be gold. But anyway, we're starting to dig targets again. Here we go. All right, the new beach just turned over something. Y'all ready to check it out? I don't know what it is. I haven't pulled out yet. But I can definitely see something in the sand. Can y'all see it? It was an eight, so it could be gold. Holy smoke, that is a big ring. It could be steel too, but that is definitely a ring. Could it be gold? Not looking like it right now, but definitely a recent lost ring. Probably tungsten carbide, but pretty cool. I'll take it all day long. It's a big ring to the hand on it, yeah. All right, here we go. We're going to Put it up and keep getting up. Here we go. What number you got on, John Boy? I'm not even getting one up yet. But I'm, here, I'm hearing the tone. I'm you hearing the tone? Me. But no number. Okay, let's see what we got here. Nothing, John Boy. Right, I got here. nothing. We're not going to dig that one. All right, there's John Boy right there. We got the beach packed in NATO. Check it out. It's a Saturday. And, uh, and we got a lot of people at the beach here. Hey! We got a lot of people down here. Look at it. It's pretty, pretty packed down here. The depositors are coming in full force. All right, here we go. Stay tuned. Hi, right, we got a coin spill here. Look at this. One, two, three, maybe four. And we got one out of the out right here. It's a quarter. But we got about five coins right here we're going to dig out. They're all in here. Somebody dropped a whole mess of coins in here. All right, we'll get them all out. Stay tuned. Yep. You're still hitting the hole, but getting it, getting it out here. All right, we're going to be digging these out for a while, so I'm going to cut the camera off and dig. Okay. All right, I've used an Equinox all day. Didn't ever use a Deus, and I did pretty good with it. I've got a lot of coins, got two pieces of silver. But I did, I did take it to water one time, John Boy. I hope I didn't flood your Equinox out, but uh, 
right now it looks okay. <laughs> That's the whole thing we hate about them because it, it floods us. And we want to jump in the water sometimes. We want to jump right down in the water sometimes, so we got to be ready to do that. Uh, John Boy used a DAS. I think I'd rather have John Boy's target with the DAS than I would have with the Knox. I think the DAS wins the day with that big old silver dollar. That's awesome, man. All right, we'll go home and check everything out. So stay tuned.